I'm going to give a brief overview of variegates, commonly referred to as spins, swirls, or ripples. These are the colorful ribbons in ice cream that not only add visual appeal, but come in an endless variety of flavors to complement about any flavor imagined. There are basically two types of variegates, water-based and oil-based. Water-based variegates have water as the main building block. Thus, they require thickeners such as pectin, cornstarch, or food gums, including xanthan gum, uh, guar, or locust bean gum, to give them the viscosity or thickness needed to hold up as the rich vein found in ice cream. Up until a few years ago, these were the primary variegates used in the ice cream industry. This then brings us to oil-based variegates. These are composed of vegetable fat, such as coconut oil, as the main building block, which sets up firm when frozen. So unlike water-based variegates, these don't require additional thickeners to deliver the vein appearance. A good example of this is Blue's Tracks Fudge, which is known for its dark color and rich fudge texture that people of all ages crave. The most recent innovation in variegates is the oil-based textured variegate. Like other water and oil-based variegates, these typically have an added color and or flavor, but in addition, these contain some type of crumb, such as graham, pretzel, or cookie crumbs, that add a unique texture to the variegate, as well as enhancing the overall flavor. This type of variegate is being seen more and more in the marketplace, bringing with it many new, unique, and exciting flavors. This wouldn't be complete if I didn't give a word of caution about using oil-based variegates. Unlike water-based variegates, always use care not to get any water in oil-based variegates because just a little bit can make them thick and sludgy to the point where they won't be usable and will need to be discarded. And no one wants that. You've heard the expression, oil and water don't mix. This also applies with variegates. Now I hope this gives you a little better understanding of variegates and that you never look at those colorful eye-catching swirls in your ice cream quite the same again.